I went like this with the. What are you drawer, holding in your hand? The drawer handle. Cannon, have you been smoking in the car? Uh, I the type of smoke. <laughs> Any kind of smoke? Maybe. <laughs> He's so silly. Good morning and welcome to the vlog. It is a rainy Saturday it's here like in East Tennessee. It smells like ashes in here. That's well, because we have cat litter in here. But That's it probably like yogurt. It's probably the cat litter, dust or whatever. We're taking off garbage and it smells smoky in here. Today, yeah, we can't roll down the window, so it's raining and cold. But we are heading off to the dump, and then it's clear my way. And then we are going to Walmart. We are, that's the store. Walmart to pick up some our last bit of Christmas gifts, save one. And then off to um, Food City, where we'll be getting football food, because it's football time in East Tennessee yeah that's right the bowl the bowl game season kicks off today there's five games and Tracy and I I don't know if you call her Tracy or not I call her Tracy but, <laughs> but we do this thing where we pick the winners of all the ball games and it's kind of like a competition the winner the loser buys the winner uh, dinner wherever they want to go so yep. that's kind of a little bet that we have that we do every year we do it for the the bowl games during football season then we do it for March Madness yep. as well for college basketball it's yeah Jeremy's actually won some like gift cards <laughs> and stuff uh, did you win on the bowl games last year no I won I won at March Madness Mar I know won, uh, and the year before was it also March Madness about the year before is a bowl game so yeah so yeah, yeah, I mean, he's actually got like some cash. And, I mean, we don't gamble, but it's like some sites will uh, have places where you can put in for free, like your picks or whatever. And then he like came in third. Was it third for March Madness? Uh-huh. Yeah, I've got a $100 gift card, so that was That was, that was really cool. I yeah, I wish I had $100, too. I wish I had $200. Jerry turned in all the claims for his... Um, window for his car yesterday so that is in the works and we'll keep you updated with that uh, unfortunately our insurance we have a thousand dollar deductible so yeah I'm hoping yeah. I'm hoping the window uh, just the rear window itself and the installation should not cost a thousand dollars because you can get a I called around yesterday and I could get a whole new convertible top for twelve hundred fifty dollars but it has to have a good window yeah so Got to start with the window first and go from there. That's right. I don't know if it's too much. Maybe we just say, give us the window, and then we'll just take it down there and get a top. Yeah, I'm considering that. Yeah, so I mean, we got options. We got things in the work, but God has been good to us. He's blessed us greatly. At least we do have insurance. And we got the school to back us up. They could have very easily said, well, you can't prove it happened on our property or whatever, but they didn't. They're pretty certain it happened there. We're not sure where it happened, but at this point, we're pretty certain that somebody did try to bust it and that the cold weather aggravated it, so, it made it worse, so, that, that's where we stand. I'm sorry about the windshield wipers. It always sounds like somebody's cutting the cheese with the windshield wipers. But yeah, we've already had breakfast, and I've already made Ken and gag this morning. I'll let him tell you about it. Okay. How, did, how did mom try to gag you this morning? Oh, she tried to give me this pickle. <laughs> Apple pickle. It was watermelon rind pickle. He was off. Don't ever eat them. <laughs> they're good. They're a southern no, they're tradition. Oh. They almost made me throw up in all my good eggs. <laughs> How were your eggs this morning? Good. Your mother made those. Hey, that's pretty good. Thank you. Me. Stop cutting the cheese, Jeremy. Taking out the trash. Can you read this? It says Ted Cruz is the Zodiac Killer. Good to know. We are 
are out in the dreariness. We just went to Walmart and struck out completely. Not gift cards we wanted there. No coffee pot that we're trying to get. We did run into my aunt. So that's about it. Something's on fire. Do we want to go in here? Okay, so we're going to go in here and hopefully um, find some gift cards and Kroger's. Wish us luck. Okay, we had great success at Kroger's. We were in and out in under five minutes. They had exactly the gift cards we were looking for, so let that be a lesson to you. Then we came to the City of Food, and we got some barbecue sandwiches, which Kenan is holding behind us. And you want to tell us about them, Kenan? They are super good. If you ever get a chance, come down here and get some. So now we are going home, and and we're going to eat, and then uh, get on with our day. I'll check in with you guys later. Explain to everybody what you just did. I went like this with the What are you drawer, holding in your hand? The drawer handle. Yeah, me too. Life with teenagers. Hashtag boys. Look at that. Well, I guess I have an unexpected repair I need to do today. What have you got to say for yourself? It wasn't me. It was him. Take responsibility. <laughs> Just say, I'm sorry, Mom. I'm sorry, Mom. Oh, I can see a little peach fuzz on you. Alright, here's a little start of my Christmas baskets. I'm doing three this year. I'm doing one for my bonus mom. One for my... I almost said stepmom. <laughs> bonus mom is my stepmom. One for my mother-in-law, and then I'm doing one for my next door neighbor, next door neighbor Terry and her family. So uh, my facial scrub, and I'm putting is... it in these cool jars I got from Dollar Tree. And I'm not going to show you guys how I do the facial scrub because I actually already have a video about that. If you look on my make playlist, you can find it. But yeah, I'm going to do that right now. Ta-da! The facial scrub is done. Yay! Woo! Now I'm going to work on the eye cream. The eye cream is just two teaspoons of coconut oil and then about eight capsules of vitamin E. Easy to, to mix up if you guys want to do that for yourselves. Here, I'll show you. This is about four teaspoons or so of coconut oil and then you just got a vitamin E capsule and I've already taken a pen. And then you just do it like that. Or if you find vitamin E oil, that will work as well. But yeah, that's it. And then you blend it up. And uh, it makes a really, really good eye cream. Especially for those under eye areas. So, yeah. I always make this every year. I don't know if my moms use it or not. But I make it every year anyways. Okay, there's the eye cream. Facial scrub and eye cream. Same but different. I'm done. You know I'm not one for one-upmanship. You're not? No, but if one of one of my presents, you have a Leonard Skinner song clue. Uh-huh. I figured I would do the same for you. Give me tea for Texas. Give me tea for Tennessee. Give me tea for Tracy. She's the one I love. Uh, a vol something or another a power t t-shirt you were closer with the diffuser <laughs> he's been wrapping my gifts this afternoon he's brought up two one's what was my clues baby one of them said caution this this gift might be difficult to use and then the last one i said that was a diffuser yeah you would but the last one said uh, he He's gone. This one says, Dear Nephew, do not apply for a position with my company. Nepotism is not allowed. <laughs> I have no idea. And here, now we're even on Leonard Skinner clues. Yes, we are. Even though it's not their original song, they did it on the live album. It's supposed to know. Thank you, dear. Okay, guys, I have worked on this pretty much all day. I like these little collapsible drawer things, but man, I just, I don't know. These jars are heavy. So, I'm going to show you what I got in here. Here's the eye cream. And it's got these little containers at the dollar store. They were like six for a dollar. 
This is the loofah, and I grew this myself. If you guys don't know, a loofah is just a type of gourd, and it looks just like this on the inside, and you have to peel off the skin after it dries, and then these little channels right here have seeds, so you have to shake out all the seeds. Here is the watermelon brine pickles, and these are a sweet things that taste almost like applesauce it's like a tangy thing it's a southern kind of thing and this is the dandelion jelly and it oh look at that that's so good man I'm telling you dandelion jelly is so good it's like honey it's like tasting sunshine mm, love dandelion jelly and then this is some apple butter and i grew these apples myself so yeah i made that and then this is the facial scrub so it just so happened right when i finished making the first basket and i'm gonna you know lay these down and make it look a little bit better but anyways when i got finished my neighbor terry came by and she brought us a christmas gift mm, she made these herself i'm so proud of her she did a very good job they smell very good and they taste good mm love me some bugles mm. her father used to make this every year so to honor him she made it she did a really good job so it was just fortunate how that worked out because as soon as I finished the basket there was a knock on the door so I was able to go ahead and give her her Christmas gift too and it's funny because this is actually the first year we ever gave each other Christmas gifts and we had gifts for each other that's hilarious okay so we're going to end the vlog i have pretty much worked on that stuff all day and kenan got to earn his video games back so he's been playing video games he's a very happy camper so you excited about tomorrow mm -hmm. what happens tomorrow i have to go back to school the next day Christmas is starting tomorrow. Well, what, where are we going tomorrow? No, no. <sighs> what is wrong with you? We're going to Nana and Papa's. Where are they? I think we'll bite your <laughs> nose off. Hey, you made fun of my room, so. I thought it was right. What did I say about your room? It sucked. <laughs> yeah. It's messy. It smells like boys. This vlog sucks. It smells like boys. Smells like videos. This video smells like gingerbread. <laughs> I did. I was going to make some molasses cookies, some ginger snap molasses cookies tonight. I ran out of time. Mm -hmm. I guess I could still do it, but I'm tired. I am. So did you have a good Vlogmas day? He helped carry in all the groceries and stuff. In fact, he carried up most of the groceries. Oh, what happened? What happened to the groceries? Okay. The one grocery I don't <laughs> carry is eggs. And she drops them. I did. <laughs> Jerry always is like, he doesn't put them with the other groceries. And he always makes me carry them and stuff. He brought them in. He, he gave them to me. And I went to step out of the car. And I thought I had the handles. But the way they were twisted, I actually had between the handles. You know how that is with a plastic bag. And it went pow on the ground. And Jeremy turned around and he said, you didn't. No, he said, you're kidding. I was like, I'm not kidding. This really happened. Look, they're on the ground. So I broke three of the eggs. Uh, All right, we will talk to you guys tomorrow, which it will be a fun Christmas out vlog. And until then, what's your closing statement? Try not to kill your teenage boy. All right, talk to you <laughs> guys later. Bye. <laughs> Follow me on YouTube, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Facebook, follow me on Instagram, follow me on Pinterest, follow me on Twitch, follow me on MySpace. What the hell is MySpace? Follow me on Musical.ly, follow me on Reddit, follow me on the sidewalk, follow me on the road, follow me on WhatsApp, follow me on Daily Motion. Follow, 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 follow. Hey.